All right, hi YouTube. Um, I'm just gonna show you guys how to sew on rhinestones. Um, <clears throat> like the ones on these earrings that I'm gonna finish it up in a little bit. Yeah, these. Um, oh, by the way, this is Bobby. <laughs> I do beadwork, native beadwork, but I do a contemporary and also do a gold old style. So we're gonna take a look at my beadwork stuff. Right here is my little tray with some beads in it that I love to use. Bags of beads, my necklace I made for myself, orders, more beads, more beads, bread. <laughs> my rhinestones, Swarovski crystal ones, so on. My buckskins, my all kinds of stuff, more beads, necklaces, binders, portfolios, notebooks with designs in it. And anyways, I'm going to show you the side I'm making. I'm making the other side to this. See? I made this beaded earring and I made all these ones right here. See? Oh, crap. My color. Anyways, yeah, like that one, which is about almost five inches. Some dentillion earrings. Sorry. <laughs> Hair ties right here, right here, more earrings, more hard earrings. Anyways, I was going to show you how to do um, rhinestones. I'm just going to do the outline of this one. Sorry. I'm trying to do this, okay. And rhinestones kind of like this one. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I'm trying to do this with one hand, so... You take your rhinestone and you just go you basically just sew it like that all the way around and then you pull your thread all the way through oh what up and then once that all the way through on that side just go on the other side of the other two little threads on there I'm sorry, this video is kind of sucky. I don't have my video cam, my video ah, person here. Uh, okay. Let's see if I can this. Okay. And then just loop it over. Like that. And then just do that all the way around. Like that. Yeah, these are new earrings. I just started the, earlier, so I'm trying to finish them. To sell at the powwow tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Got lots of stuff to finish. But yeah, you just keep you just keep on sewing it. and then like when you get back to here where you start it, what you do is that you take the end of your rhinestone like this one. If I can get it, okay. See how it's the end of it? Uh, and this kind of guy, it's like a hard plastic, it's not soft plastic, so you gotta take your lighter. And just sort of put it towards it just for a few seconds. As soon as that plastic melts, you just shove your needle right through it and it comes out just right. Yeah, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> and that's how you sew on rhinestones. And you just do that all the way around your project, like that one. Or like on this one. Yeah, Dentillion's Rock. Or that one. But yeah, this is my little beading area. I got lots more beads in my room. This is just my little kitchen setup and my thread. Size D thread. Got this from a little shop in Oklahoma. Yeah, six ounces. And more random stuff to put on earrings. So, so on, so forth. But yeah. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked it, YouTube.